As the COVID-19 pandemic situation across the world continues to evolve, cruise lines are constantly adapting their health and safety protocols. Following recommendations from government as well as health authorities, several brands across the world are now updating their vaccine policy requirements as the months progress. In today's latest cruise news update for the 22nd of September, we take a look at some of the major cruise lines across the world and their current vaccination policies. But before we jump right into the video, may I please request you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also activate notifications so that way you stay updated whenever I drop my next latest cruise news update. Now, without further ado, let's get started. Number 1. Carnival Cruise Line Currently sailing from several United States home ports, Carnival Cruise Line requires that most of their guests need to be fully vaccinated against COVID-19. The company has mentioned on their website that the policy is that everyone must be vaccinated with a very small number of exceptions for children under the age of 12 and those who are unable to get vaccinated. According to Carnival, this approach exceeds the requirements for vaccinated cruises under the CDC's guidance and meets requirements set by the destination visited during the cruises. Guests are considered to be fully vaccinated when they have received their final dose of an approved COVID-19 vaccine at least 14 days prior to sailing and have a proof of vaccination. Number 2. Royal Caribbean International According to Royal Caribbean's website, vaccination requirements vary by port of departure and age group. For cruises departing from all United States home ports, all guests aged 12 and older must present proof of COVID-19 vaccination with the final dose of their vaccine administered at least 14 days before sailing. For cruises departing European ports such as Barcelona and Southampton in England, guests aged 18 and older are required to be fully vaccinated for COVID-19 at least 14 days prior to sailing. Vaccination requirements may vary by itinerary as well. According to the company, information regarding the latest requirements for each departure port will be sent to all booked guests within 30 days before setting sail. Number 3. Norwegian Cruise Line Norwegian Cruise Line is sailing 100% vaccinated cruises through the end of the year. Therefore, all guests which also include children and crew embarking through the 31st of December 2021 will be required to be fully vaccinated against COVID-19 to sail in that period. MSC Cruises MSC Cruises vaccination policy varies by region and country of origin. Through the 31st of October 2021, United States guests cruising from a United States home port are required to be fully vaccinated 14 days before the cruise. If you are unable or unwilling to show proof of vaccination, you will be denied boarding, is what MSC has stated on their website. Similarly, a United States passenger aged 12 and older will be required to be fully vaccinated to sail on MSC's Mediterranean and Northern Europe cruises. European guests, however, may be subjected to different vaccination policies. Italian residents who cruise in the Mediterranean and Northern Europe, for instance, can embark with a negative molecular COVID-19 test taken 48 hours before the cruise. Number 5. Princess Cruises Currently sailing from the United States and the United Kingdom, Princess Cruises is operating vaccinated cruises only. According to the company, the requirements are in accordance with the health authority directives and follow the CDC definitions, with guests and crew vaccination rates close to 100%. All cruises through the 31st of December are currently only available to guests who have received their final dose of an approved COVID-19 vaccine at least 14 days prior to the beginning of the cruise and also have proof of vaccination. According to Princess, the guests will be asked to confirm they are fully vaccinated by providing proof of vaccination before they get on board. Number 6. 
Celebrity Cruises. According to Celebrity Cruises website, all crew and guests who are eligible to be vaccinated must be fully vaccinated with all doses administered at least 14 days prior to sailing. The company will also continue to abide by CDC guidance and require that all guests 12 years and older to be fully vaccinated with all COVID-19 vaccine doses administered at least 14 days prior to sailing. Number 7. Holland America Line While Holland America Line's health protocol varies by region, it requires their guests to be fully vaccinated for every destination the brand is sailing in 2021. According to Holland America Line's website, cruises sailing through the 31st of December 2021 are only available to those guests who have received their final dose of an approved COVID-19 vaccine at least 14 days prior to the beginning of the cruise and also have proof of vaccination. Number 8. Saga Cruises Saga Cruises is asking all their guests to have both doses of a COVID-19 vaccine prior to boarding. After resuming service with domestic sailings in the United Kingdom in the month of June 2021, the two-ship British cruise line has resumed their international operations, offering cruises to the Baltic and the Mediterranean regions. Number 9. Bahamas Paradise Cruise Line Bahamas Paradise Cruise Line reviewed its COVID-19 vaccine policy in the month of August 2021, following an order implemented by the Bahamas Customs and Excise Department. According to a statement by the company, the company is now requiring all guests 12 years and older to be fully vaccinated against COVID-19. These new rules are in place until the 31st of October 2021. Number 10. TUI Cruises TUI Cruises guests are currently required to show that at least TUI Cruises guests are currently required to show at least one negative COVID-19 test before cruise departure. Vaccination requirements in the meantime vary by country as well as region. When sailing to the Caribbean, for instance, guests must also show proof that they are fully vaccinated against COVID-19. According to the company, guests will receive all the important information and requirements for their trip via email before the start of their journey. And with that, we conclude our latest cruise news updates for the 22nd of September. Thank you so much for watching ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed watching this cruise news update, a subscribe to my channel and a thumbs up for my video will really be appreciated. Until next time, you take care and stay safe.